Now, this is a pretty weird turn of events. <laughs> now, you might be saying, oh, C.com, there's no Nintendo Direct in February. You announced it. Yeah, well, I've had this video since the 1st of February. It's currently Valentine's Day, and I'm not lonely in the sense that I have no friends. I'm lonely in the sense that there's no Nintendo Direct announcement. But this video is too good to pass up, so I'm going to let you guys see it anyway. Granted, it's kind of expected. Like, we can always hope for a Nintendo Direct, but there really isn't much to announce. There's four games. There's Mario vs. Sonic Young Remake, Princess Peach Showtime, Luigi's Mansion 2, and Thousand Year Door remakes. Those are really the only things we know and really the only things we need until we get any confirmation on like the Switch 2, Switch Pro, whatever, which I've made a whole video on that. Go check it out. I'll probably say to do that in the video as well. I'm just forgetting if I actually say it in the video because it's been so long since I've edited it. Crazy. There might be a partner showcase sometime soon. That's my only like prediction or maybe something small. Like there's not much to announce. Maybe just show off. Imagine they show off Silk Song. That'd be, I would laugh so hard. Oh my goodness gracious. I'm just looking forward to whatever Nintendo is cooking up next because I have no shortage of games to play. If you follow me on Twitter, you'll notice that I just finished the first game out of my backlog of 50. I got a ways to go. Subscribe if you're new, like if you like the video, and uh, enjoy my predictions for a Nintendo Direct that probably will not happen. All right. <laughs> Now with this green screen, I summon Nintendo Direct predictions. Here we go. You're probably watching this the exact day the Nintendo Direct announcement happened, probably down to the minute. I probably saw the Nintendo Direct announcement on my phone and just went boop and made this video public. So if here you are, here you are. So now let's talk about some predictions I have for the Direct tomorrow. First off, we only have four games that we know of releasing this year, and that is the Luigi's Mansion 2 remake, the Mario vs. Donkey Kong remake, the Paper Mario Thousand Year Door remake, and Princess Peach Showtime. Three of those four games are remakes, which is pretty crazy. I suspect we are going to get way more remakes in this Direct because everyone is saving their super good games for the Switch to launch. I'm just going to go down the list of Nintendo franchises and tell you what I think might happen, which could spiral into who knows what. So let's talk about it. First off, we have the Super Mario series. Now, I don't think any more Mario things are going to be announced. All four games that we know are coming out this year have been related to Mario in one way, shape or form. You know, Mario vs. Donkey Kong, Paper Mario, Peach and Luigi. So we are not going to get any new Mario news until June of this year when a new Nintendo Direct pops up showing off the Switch 2 and all of that cool stuff. We'll probably get one of those special presentation videos like we got for the Nintendo Switch back in 2017. God, that was so long ago. If we are going to get anything Mario related in this Nintendo Direct that is new, it's going to be a Dr. Mario game, like an eShop game, Dr. Mario 99 even. Who knows? I'm just shot in the dark, shot in the dark. Scrolling down this list more, I see Metroid and yep, Metroid Prime 4 will be announced. Or I guess it's already announced. We'll get a trailer. Metroid Prime 4 will get a trailer at this Nintendo Direct, either to open it or to cap it off or some. It's going to be in the Direct one way or the other, even if it's just 30 seconds, not even, even if it's just five seconds of like a teaser and like Samus is going around, you know, being all cool as Samus does. We're going to get something and I'm going to be ecstatic. Of course, Metroid Prime 4 news will probably happen closer to the release date of Metroid Prime 4, which I'm assuming might be November, October, or whenever the Switch 2 launch day is, and we're gonna get more info in June or in like the Switch 2 presentation, something like that. In terms of Splatoon announcements, I think we are going to get a trailer for Side Order, the DLC, which looks pretty cool. I'm not really sure what it exactly it is yet, but I guess we'll have to find out in this trailer. Pikmin 4 and Mario Wonder have been two fantastic games that have recently come out, but people always want more with games, so we might see some DLC announcements for either of those, one or the other or both, you never know. Personally, I'm not a big fan of this. I don't really think Pikmin 4 or Mario Wonder need DLC. I think they are completed games as is, and to add more would kind of just be adding more for adding more sake when the games are already complete packages as is. You should play Pikmin 4 is what I'm saying. You should play Pikmin 4. Now, there's usually one announcement for this little lad in every single Nintendo Direct, and that is Kirby. Now, I don't think we're going to get anything Kirby. I know, I just I just completely contradicted myself. I know how Laboratory is working on the next 3D Kirby, probably, so I'm very excited to see just how gorgeous that game looks on Switch 2, because Kirby is always such a beautiful series to look at, which is very funny because you are literally playing as a pink circle with, like, no fidelity. It's just a pink circle. That's it. Maybe, maybe, guess what? New sequel, Kirby is going to be like a glass orb and all the reflection quality is going to be absolutely insane. <laughs> I don't think we're going to see anything Xenoblade at all. There has been a rumor going around about a Xenoblade X remake, remaster, 
something, but honestly, I think that's someone making it up, because that's not happening. I don't believe it one bit. Mm -mm. If that actually happens, then um, this video simply did not exist. Yeah, I'll pop off, granted, I'll pop off, but I don't think it'll exist. The more I think about this Nintendo Direct, the more I think that we don't really have a lot of games to show unless we're putting them out directly for the Switch 2. But here's the thing. If we're putting them out directly for the Switch 2, we probably need to specify that they're going to be on the Switch 2. So would it be possible to announce the Switch 2 in some way, shape, or form during this Direct? Maybe just say, we are working on a new console, and here's a game that is going to be on the new console, but not specifically say what the new console is. I feel like they could go that approach, and that would build a lot of hype, but I don't know. Nintendo could maybe run the route of doing something like the Switch launch trailer, which happened back in October or something, and then there was a presentation in January, and then it released in March. If we line up that timing, October, November, December, January, that's four months, February, March, April, May, June, close enough, right? They put another direct out in May or June, which is the big presentation, and then it releases in September. No, September, October, right? That could work, that could work. I could see that happening, but I don't know, I don't know. A game that I think no one really expects anymore to be announced is the Twilight Princess HD and Wind Waker HD rumored ports that have apparently been going on for years and years on end. I, it's been so long. It's, it's just been so long. I'm tired. I'm tired, boss. I don't want to speculate on these anymore. If they do get announced, that is going to be awesome, and I would love to see that. But I just don't think it is going to happen. I think something more likely would be a full-scale remake, like Final Fantasy VII Remake, everything completely redone almost, of Wind Waker, Twilight Princess, or even Ocarina of Time. I don't think Majora's Mask, though. Put one of those games in the Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom engine, and you just, oh my god, you just go crazy with it? and one of the best-selling games of all time, and highest-rated games of all time. If you make Wind Waker open world, open world, instead of just, you know, open world, you know what I mean? That would be incredible. Definitely play Wind Waker. You should, you should definitely play Wind Waker. Now, I've thought about Super Smash Bros. quite a lot, and yeah, I have nothing. If Nintendo wants to put out Super Smash Bros. Ultimate on another console, I don't think it would be very feasible, because there's so many licensing issues that go into putting a game onto another console. So they would probably just say, hey, let's make this Switch 2 backwards compatible and just put Smash Ultimate on there. I think that would work out way better. Another series I'm looking at here, Chibi Robo. I don't think so. Oh yeah, that also reminds me. Hollow Knight Silk Song. Maybe? Wait a minute, the Olympics are summer this year? What? Huh? I was gonna say we get a new Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Winter Games, but what the heck? They're in summer this year? The winter one's the best one! I feel betrayed. And also I got another idea for Kirby. Kirby Air Ride, City Trial, Battle Royale, free to play. Plop it on the Switch, plop it on the Switch 2, plop it on every single console actually. Because people need to play that. I think that about covers it though. I'm looking at all of these things and not really seeing much. But if you guys want to see my actual predictions on what the Switch 2 could be, do check out the video. Yet again, I said it before, but I'll say it again. Because I think I'm kind of cooking with the idea and having Nintendo Land as a launch title would be awesome. I'm not really going into this Nintendo Direct with any expectations, maybe barring Metroid Prime 4. That's it. That's all I really want. If I don't get it, that's okay. I know the game is being made. I know it wasn't canceled because we would have heard about it. I'm just waiting. I'm just waiting to see whatever they got cooking up. I think I have no expectation. Probably going to hear more about the four games that we've got cooking up for this year. And that's about it. I hope to enjoy the Nintendo Direct, which I will be streaming uh, soon. You'll probably see the scheduled stream like right now. It might be in an end screen, something. Depends on... <laughs> Depends on when I can actually schedule the stream. Like if you like the video, like if you think these predictions will happen, subscribe if you think they won't. Bye bye.